<laughs> yeah, that's a puzzle I don't want to solve. Not at I all. I love her even more after every yes. week, man. She is incredible, and she is an absolute problem for any opponent in MMA. I can't wait to see her uh, continuing to fight. It's amazing. Same thing here. Also amazing, it is Friday, and your crew taking you into the weekend on Sports Nation. Ardo Cow. Tony Collins and Arda, we got to talk NFL because the third Thursday of August brought us the second week of the preseason. All eyes were on Philly. These options. And you know what the question now is becoming, do, when do you start Cam? You know, do you mm. start him before week four? Do you wait after Tom Brady gets to them or after? franchise or at least in the quarterbacks in the years to come but you have Cam Newton's really fighting for his job now. Last year weren't necessarily in his favor, but He's been playing great preseason, so you got to wonder if you have that advantage of, okay, you're a little bit more of a veteran presence here. Let's at least start you week one and see what happens there. And you know what's really cool that his teammates have been saying, like, oh, my gosh, the strides that Cam has made from last season to this one. But, hey, if you're a Patriots fan, you got to be happy for this season. <laughs> All right, what else we got? Rotation does matter, yes. and this matters, yes. and this is just making strides and just – I mean, even for this old hag here, that's inspiring. Man. <laughs> Seriously, continue uh, I'm to follow. right there with you, first of all. <laughs> but second of all, you know what impresses me mm. the most? Yes, you're absolutely right. Uh, representation, diversity, it matters, and we should be continuing to shine that spotlight. Also, I want to make a note that, like, think about the fact mm -hmm. that she's still an active athlete, and that is... That is a 24-7 job in itself. I have to be in tip-top shape. I have to practice. I have to perform well in games. I have to be mentally ready, and, which is incredible. And to add a note after last night, she has now the most three-pointers made in franchise history for the Sparks. Oh, by the way, just, I know, just let me just drop that little <laughs> nugget there. Just pick that up. I mean, unbelievable. You rock, girl. All right, let oh! us go. <laughs> and now we welcome into Sports Nation live from Chicago AEW commentator and in-ring performer Paul White. Paul, thank you so much for being with us here. <laughs> hey, good morning, and thank you guys very much for having me. <laughs> oh, my gosh, Pop. As uh, we just saw on Wednesday, you announced you'll be making your long away to return to the ring at the All Out pay-per-view on September 5th, but you've had five hip operations in the past 18 months. How ready do you <laughs> feel to get back in the ring and do your thing? Oh, thank you so much. This has been so much fun. And we want to remind everyone at home that you can watch Paul on commentary for AEW Elevation every Monday and watch Paul's AEW in-ring debut on Sunday, September 5th on pay-per-view. And of course, do not forget a new Rampage tonight at 10 Eastern. Thank you so much, Paul. Thank you, Paul. Hey, thank you guys very, very yes. Always. I Okay, go. Give it to me. No. Absolutely. It is not. Isn't it like Stop two pieces of people. bread and a filling in the middle? It's th th This silliness needs to end. The so, hot dog is in its own category, in my humble opinion end. here, okay? <laughs> it's its own category. We don't need this. Because it's part of the sandwich family. How is it, though? Oh, my God. Sorry. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> Look, I can't believe my... that voting was so... You... <laughs> yeah. What do you guys think? That's how, that's how bad we feel about this. Go eat some hot, hot dog dogs. is not a sandwich, people. Whatever he says, he's cranky today. Today, but it's also today National Chocolate Pecan Pie Day. And dun dun dun, we got some desserts here to try while we finish this because this is so good. All right, thank you. And we you. gotta give a shout out. Let me actually thank you. Uh, give a shout out to the people who made this amazing pie. Mm -hmm. Pecan Pie is courtesy of Granny's Pie Factory in East Harvard, Oh, thank you yes. very much. It's very nice. Oh, wait. <laughs> I appreciate it very much. What are you doing? Uh, I, I need a larger slice of pie because I want to give a shout out. This is my pecan pie. Cheers to Henrik Lundqvist, who just announced his retirement mm. on Twitter. Congratulations on a fantastic career. You were always nice to me when I worked with the Rangers. Career for Hank, and now he hangs him up. That's awesome. And I'm going okay, to eat this I'm now. Like, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to eat this now. <laughs> this is so good. Bye, everybody. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next week here on Sports Nation. For Art, I'm Tony. Enjoy your week and stay safe and have fun at the same time. A hot dog, <laughs> not a sandwich. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Peck and pie.